Oops. Using that one to set the zero. This is straight. Almost nothing. <laughs> that is uh, straight. So if the tailstock is high or low, why is it when we got it measured when we set it up here? Is it this thing here is falling off or something? Yeah, that's good though. Oops. That's great. Um, let's just confirm once more that it's not great like this. Drops one thousand one hundred two two three four four over that distance drops right it's dropping so you're telling me that the tailstock is not high enough. But when I matched it up, which was down this end, and it was with the tailstock in at an inch and at two inches, so again that was here in this first bit, and in fact that first bit there is actually quite good. Um, so does the table drop off at the rear, or does it actually all need to come up? and then be pointed down slightly, something like that. Okay, I'll we'll have to keep thinking about this. It's insane how many variables there are in this sort of thing. That's remarkably straight. And then it pulls it. Can I see which, exactly which way it's pulling it? It's down. So it's pulling it down, which would imply the tailstock is low. Is it? Um, and then if I take it back, it goes up. It's pulling it down. That's effectively nothing. So if that's parallel, um, that's parallel, and the other rod was telling me it should go up a couple of hundreds. 
to counter the, I think, three or four hundreds. It seemed to be pulling it down, if that was right. And if I did that, then what would happen with the um, centers? Which I'm going to check again right now. That's so good, it's so close. And if anything, it would need to go higher, which is what we're saying, is that it would need to go higher. Um, still got the uh, 0.5. It could go a teeny tiny bit higher. I don't know if that's 400s, but 200s, but maybe it is. I mean, that's the, yeah, maybe it is. Um, these are 0 0.5. Well, I've put 0.75 in, so I'll have the options to put in two 0.5s to give me 0 0.1, or a 0 0.75 and a 0 0.5, and so on and so forth. Um, so that option is there. It is there. All I need to do is get myself some fresh bits like this. And I might cut a fresh piece. And just try it out. Just so you know, when I cut these with a blade, with a knife, I'm then deburring them so that they're dead flat just because that edge comes up a bit when you cut them. So I'm deburring them with the, um, with the back of a knife blade, like that, just by putting it on a flat surface and then scraping it, get rid of all the edge bits. Seems to work. Two fifty-five. Exactly like that. And on the other side, we'll do the same. Get that one out. And again, I could go thinner by using 2.5s instead of the 0.75 or I could go thicker by doing 2.75s which is 150 which is 305s Ooh, okay so now how was this so the, that side was stayed as it was I'll tweak that one up We'll tweak that up. This, in fact, will get a big tweak. Give that a big tweak. Then I'll we'll shove them in and undo them. See what happens. Uh, yes, I do believe that is improved. I can feel it going a bit sideways, but the height is better. That makes a tiny amount of difference, just a tiny amount. Well, it should have been exactly 0.05 is what it should have been. And I was trying to make up 0.04 or something like that. Uh, that's... Um, Uh, 
Oh, that's beautiful. That's bloody good. They're all tight. That's tight. That's tight. And that, let's check that. Very nice. Okay. So we have added 0.05 to the height. <laughs> How about that? How about that? And with the lever off, on, no change. Doesn't get much better than that. And without that in, we had run out. One, two, three, just over three. Well, three, actually. Two and a half, now that it's settled. Two and a half. That's the run out of that whole thing. Two and a half, under three. Now, if I put the center in and it locks it up, and we lock that up. What happens? It becomes very stable, right? Good, but and then what happens if we run it along like this? Don't change. I'm very happy with you the way you are. It's not changing, huh? Oh. <laughs> ah, tell me that isn't an improvement. Oh, well, tell me that isn't fixed. God, that was worth it. There. Now, I'm only going to there because that's where I can cut to, right? The chuck is in the way there. Um, oh, so move this to where it's on zero. It's gone half a needle under just immediately. Oops, zero, 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 zero. Where are we? Can't see. Oh, watch it on the screen. Zero, 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 zero. And there's the end of the bar. Beat that. Beat that. Everyone can beat that, I'm sure. Wow. Very happy with that. Very happy with that. I have no idea I'd be going this far, but this is this is how far you gotta go. Um so that's the figure four. Parallelism of Spindle, no, it's this one here. Headstock MT3 and MT2 centers for same height above reference plane using the rod here in the centers. Zero one, one one hundredth. I'm going to give us zero because I'm proud of that. You know, maybe zero point, maybe a thousandth, but I'm going to give it a zero. So that's five A. 0, 0.0. That's what I'm given there. So this took shims, though. This took shimming. Um, yeah. 
And as I say, when I go around YouTube looking for this, hardly anyone's talking about that. They're all just talking about, you know, using those screws to go left and right, which is, you know, a big deal. Yeah, that's, that's the easy thing. Um, but what about up and down? If that's not perfect, then why would it be perfect? Why would it? And so that bar makes sense to me now. It's just a sort of a nice parallel bar. Um, doesn't have to be perfectly straight because the hole is what's matter what matters. And uh, once you've got it stuck in your tailstock, it's got to be straight. It's got to have no run out. It's got to be parallel to the bottom here, which means it's it's parallel to this thing here, the cross slide all the way along. Yeah, bloody, bloody hell. Bloody fantastic, mate. Oh, yeah. Couldn't be happier. Time for bed, I think. Which side is the right side? That's the side. Good. Okay. So I go that way and I should hit it. Yes. Okay, that's not moving at all. Yep, that's the one. Perfect. Perfect. 